This is code.org. Let's see what we're doing. Experiment with the program by making the following modifications. Then run the program to observe the results. To do, change the condition for the last wall loop or while loop on line 34 to Jesse has paint. Then run the program. So line 34, Jesse has paint. Okay. Then run the program and observe the results. What happens when you run the program? All right, let's do this. So interesting. Notice, and what if I change it back? Okay, so when it's can move, I end up there. And when it is has paint, I'm going to end up somewhere over here. So what's going on? Well, if we go through this code with all the way down, guys, we're going to as long as while I'm on a bucket, I take the paint. So I must start on a bucket. Then as long as or while while Jesse can move, I'm going to move forward and paint pink. So remember what this does. Everything in this block here or in these curly braces here gets run over and over and over and over. Wow, that was a terrible box. Again, until this is false. So we hit here, the computer's going to hit this line and say, okay, it's a while loop. So while Jesse can move and it says, okay, can Jesse move? Well, what's Jesse? Jesse's our painter. So it's going to check wherever I am. Stop. Right here, I can move. So this would be true. I can move. And if it's true, I'll take one step forward. I'll paint pink. I'll hit the bottom. And it says, okay, back to the top. Oh, yeah, I can move. So I take another step and I paint. Take another step and paint. Another step and paint. Another step and paint. So on and so forth until I can no longer move, which would be right here. At that point, this would be false. And then it says, oh, this is false. And it drops below. And that's when I start turning. Then I move one more time once I turn. And then I turn left three times. So this is a right turn and this is a right turn. And then as long as I have paint is what we change. Well, we know I don't have any paint, right? The paint that I take up here, if you notice when I run, this number is six. I ran out of paint way over here. So by the time we get to here and it says has paint, move. Nope, I'm just going to stay facing this way forever because I no longer have any paint. And if I do not have paint, this would then be false. If this is false, it cannot run this code inside. It just bumps down to the bottom and would keep going if there's anything down here. And there's not. So, ta-da! Cool. All right. Onward.